We are checking out the Resident Evil 5 demo on the PS5. So, real quick, we're just going to adjust my camera. We're going to make my face really tiny. Because you're here to see the video and not my face, I would imagine. Or maybe you're here to only see my face and don't even care about the video, which at that point, I thank you for your viewership, but I'm a little bit concerned. All right. <laughs> not really. But, um, okay. All right. And... Okay, here we go. All right. Let's see. English, English, subtitles. We'll do subtitles. Surround sound. I'm going for the headphones. Because I got headphones on. HDR mode? Yes, please. Okay, let's see. Adjust until the square is just barely visible. So we go all the way up and then we go back down. Now this is per my TV, so I'm not sure how this comes off on Twitch, but uh, okay, that's barely visible. Yep, barely. Okay. Now what? Adjust until both blue and red areas are the same size. Hmm, interesting. I've never seen a balloon red HDR adjustment. Oh, so Oh, it was a uh, it was correct to begin with, so okay, my TV looks to be standard there, all right. Blah blah blah. Oh, I got to go to the down. You have to go down to the bottom and pretend you read it. Oh, now I can click yes because I read the whole thing. Okay. Share play data turned on. Wow. All right, here we go. And let's check out the options. Okay, camera, we'll leave that as a standard so far. Damage display. Hmm, what are the options? Okay, normal. We'll go with that. Uh, graphics, we got that. We already did that part. Audio. Okay. Dynamic range to match your surroundings. Hmm. Um, hmm. See virtual surround for headphones to on or off. Who who would not vir what virtual surround sound? Yeah, man, I would have been like, yo, they're behind me. Yo, they're above me. But um, okay. So that's background music volume. I personally always prefer to put that halfway. Halfway down. All right. Okay. Here we go, people. Let's do it. Oh, I can't. I don't have time to drink. I forgot the PS5. <laughs> Super fast. Low claps. All right. Oh, okay. I appreciate these graphics. Hmm, what is this? Okay, let's me read it. To whomever is trying to escape this place, I hope this note will be of some assistance. You don't know me, but you will have to trust me if you want to survive. First, you need to get out of the cell. No shit! If I would escape, I have to leave where I am? Well, that's the number one good tip of the day. Let's continue. Look around for a way. Get on your hands and knees if you must. Hey, kinky! Then search for the thing you will need to escape. It will be hidden where they'll least suspect silk and blood. All right, so that's that's the one real clue. 
So I have to be on the lookout for something soaked in blood. Okay. Okay. Once you get out of the dungeon, you should find yourself in a room. The door there shall lead to salvation. The light will lead you down the right path. You might hit a dead end, but do not give up. It should be a way to proceed hidden somewhere. Once you find the ladder, the only way is up. But watch out. Don't let them see you. I plan to make my escape tonight and pray that you, too, will make it out alive. Oh, yeah. You know, just my ping pong rally for a maximum. Enjoy me. Yeah, we're going to make this. Yeah. All right. Okay. All righty. So the right knob, R3, goes up and down. X should be jump, I would imagine. No. Um, oh, maybe you don't jump in this game. So let's see. Circle. Does that do anything? Triangle. Okay, that's the go to the inventory. Square. Um, all right. All right. <clears throat> Got a little bit of a line over here in my background, so I'll be right back. Sorry, guys. I'm going to adjust it. I usually broadcast at night time, but my room's a little brighter now, so I have to uh, adjust this. I'll be right back. Calm down, calm down. I'll be right back. We're like 10 seconds away from me being back. Take it easy. Take it easy. Calm down. I'm just making the video look nicer for you. All right, and see, I'm back. And now it's clear and nice. All right. Okay. Look at that fabric detail, man. That's pretty sweet. Okay, so... Get in your hands and knees if you must, right? So... I'm on my knees now. Uh-huh. There we go. All right. I'm out! Oh, I'm in another cell. But we're gonna get there. Alright. Bit of straw. Okay. Ooh, that's nasty. I can hear the wiggle mares, too. Oh, uh, look at that. That's cool. Dinner is served. Oh wait, it's it's not food. It's it's toilet filled with maggots. Nice. Okay. Oh. Hello. That door is unlocked because it's empty. Okay. Ooh, the torture rack. Yikes. Remember, we're looking for blood. Ooh, that sucks. Not a way to get abs. A good way to lose uh, belly fat, though, I guess. All right. Oh, maybe some supplies? Nope. Look at that. Got a heart in there. Oh, hello. Medicines for keeping livestock alive. Okay. I like how you just walk through the door and it opens. Like, it takes away the step of push X to open door. We know we want to open it. <laughs> so that's, I like that. Okay. Them bones, them bones, them. Dead bones. All right.
Hmm. Examine. Aha. <clears throat> Oh, that's the one we found already. But it says X. Okay, I'm confused. I'm a little conf Oh, need some kind of other item, so I have to find the item before I push X. It's weird because instead of examine, it just it takes me to my inventory. But to use another item. Okay, so I gotta find something else. You know? See, not, like, right there is... The tool, but I can't get to it, so that is not what you can use, I would assume. Okay. Hmm. There's a dead body. Welcome to the stream. Brand new Resident Evil. Eighth Village Demo. Pretty cool so far. I'm in the dungeon trying to escape. Hmm, sounds like something Hulk Hogan would say. Help me, brother! Help me, brother! Alright, let's see. Currently, I'm trying to uh, find a tool to cut a chain. If you're watching the stream, if you see it and I walk by it, type it in. I'll see your message. You'll be like, yo, dude, you just walked by it. Help me out if you can. But here we go. Oh, look at that torture device. Oof. That's not a lazy boy. That's a torture, torture boy. Oh, screws to the eyes. Ay, ay, ay. All right. All righty. Hmm. Okay. Oh, shit. Person hung up there. That's the chain I want to get. I mean, unopened. Okay. Nope. Hmm. Yeah, obviously the door's not just gonna open. Okay, so. Hmm. One of the clues was... You know what? Let, let, let's look at that clue again, since you weren't here when I first got it. Okay. So... Look on your hands and knees if you must. Okay. Search for the thing you need to escape. It will be hidden where the least suspect soaked in blood. So someplace soaked in blood is where they hid it. So we're going to crawl on our hands and knees in blood areas. Let's see. Um. So here's some blood. I was hoping it would be right there, because that's a bloody pole under a thing hidden, but it's it's not that. Hmm. This is where I came from. This is where I came from. Um, look at this. Look at that nasty toilet. You hear those maggots going around? That's nasty. Alright. Okay, so let's see here. Okay, now. So. It could be in here. 
But I have to get by the chain first. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, hello. There we go. There we go. Oh, I get it. The first time I was in here, she was sitting up. Now, since the body fell down, I could reveal reveal that it was in her back. All right, all right. Here we go. Whoop. <laughs> oh, shit. Look at that. All right. Now, the old bolt cutters. Okay. Aha! Blood. It's in here. That was cool. I'm a little disappointed I didn't see my hands reach into it, but it's still a fun game. Alright, anything else in here? It's it's funny, like, see here's a torture mask, you can screw the eyes. It's like it's not bad enough they put a mask on you. They gotta make you look funny when they torture it's like I'm causing you pain. And you look like a pig as well. It's like, man. All right. I guess after you torture so many people, you get bored, so you got to keep it creative. So, okay, that, that, that makes sense. I actually, after all. Jeez, do you think you have enough different pliers? All right. Okay, so now... Now what? Hmm... Oh, up! Oh. oh shit, I hear something. So I go towards the noise. Let's uh, actually go away from the noise. Oh shit, oh shit. What's going on here? Oh shit. Oh shit! Something's trying to get out of there. Oh fuck, we better, we better move on. Pick. Okay. 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 Now what? Now what? Oof. I'd like that door to close, but it's not closing. All right. Oof. See that 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 subtle. You see the heat wave? That's a cool graphic effect. Just the subtle, subtleness of it. All right. Okay. These are leaking. Hear something walking, growling. Oh shit! See now, right here. That's just lazy masonry. Look at that. Just smeared cement on it. Okay. Oh. Oh shit. Shit, we're gonna battle somebody soon. I, I ain't got no weapon. Oh shit, here we go, people. It's about to get real. I like how they this mess just. Oh, whoa, hello. That's not oil in the barrels of wine. That's fucking people in those barrels. Oh shit. Oh shit. I didn't see that coming. I thought it was going to be, it's like wine or something in there. I forgot this is a Resident Evil game. Oh, shit. Before I play the damn music, I'm going to look around a little bit. Oh, what we got here? This stinks so bad. Ha ha ha. Cannibalism, of course. Wow.
Oh, somebody's here, man, because the fire's lit. I wonder if the wine bottles are filled with blood. Alright, well. Now we're going to play the music and see what happens. Oh. Okay, here we go. Don't see my cabra. My cabra. I don't know. Booty butt, booty butt, booty butt cheeks. Damn, now what? Came from here. Hmm. Oh, oh I did that already. Damn, what am I missing? Did that once. Hmm. Now what? Okay, there's gotta be something here. Okay, we'll get low. Up, oh, there we go. Okay. Tricked me, it wasn't a fireplace, a mirror candle there. Okay, now what? You know it's kind of funny in these games, but you got to do it for a fact. But it's like those candles don't last that long, so that means in this world, like every day, twice a day, somebody comes down. Up, oh, time to light the candles. Time to put new candles in the escape tunnel. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. But you know, what are you gonna do? <laughs> but it's like think about that logic. This is a secret tunnel to, for the prisoner to escape. Who's lighting those damn candles every day and replacing them? <laughs> we gotta ruin everything. Not ruining it, just having some real fun. Hmm. Aha. Okay, we're taking job applications today for the candle uh, replacement in our torture house. Yeah, I'll tell you how I could do that. Sure. What's it pay? We don't kill you. That's what it pays. All right, all right. <clears throat> 1958. It was my first day working at the castle today. Ah, maybe he's the candle replacer. Uh, I was most shocked to see the masters of the house were all women. <gasps> Ooh! <laughs> That was uh, written by Austin Powers. It's like, wait a minute. No. Uh, the mistress and her daughters were very adamant. And her daughters were very adamant that they wouldn't bite. It was quite peculiar. It's been two weeks since I started working at the castle, and I'm a little afraid. Another maid, Adelia, made a mistake, and Miss Dahlia slashed her face with a knife. And at night, I can hear wailing as if ghosts roam the halls. I were to go home. Yeah, it's before uh, um, OSHA made workplace safety laws. You just slash the, the, the face of your employees. It didn't matter. There's no OSHA, no worker laws. Um, I don't know what to do. The young ladies were complaining. It was too hot and stuffy during dinner. So I opened the window just to crack. Shut it! Shut it now! They all shrieked at me in unison. I fear I may have taken... I may be taken down into the cellar. Cellar. Never to be seen of again. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. All right. This would be cool in VR. I had the uh, previous one, uh, Resident Evil 7, Biohazard in VR. Pretty cool. Alright. I think I might have to uh, play that game again, preparing for the May launch of this game. I think it launches in May. This, you know, the full version of this game launches May 2021.
Hmm. Place to leave a rope laying around. All right. Look at those graphics, man. Look at this artwork. Beautiful. Oh shit! I better hurry up. The candles are candles are almost all done. They're due for replacement. All right. Let's see. Look at that. Look at that fabric work. You just I, I appreciate the art of video games and now. All right. Let's see. Can I open these cupboards? Nope. How about this one? No. Ah, what is this? A necklace. All right. Necklace of animal bones used to ward away evil taken from me when I was thrown in that dungeon. Hmm. It didn't work too good then, did it? <laughs> oh. Is that me walking? Oh, that wasn't my footsteps. Oh, shit. That's where I came from. Nothing under there. Hmm. Seems... Obvious set. Uh, three sisters and three dresses. Hmm. A lot of hands and knees work in this game so far. So I came from there. Now what? Hmm. Up. Oh, that was a door. Just a wall. Guiding walls are sort of detailed. You can't tell the walls from the door sometimes. Just gotta look for the handle. Alright. What's in here? Ah, it is locked. I, I, I'm gonna love this game, but the only tiny little complaint I have, just because it takes away from the, the uh, immersion, is like, see, I'm trying to open the door. There's no hand graphic. Like, I mean, no complaint, it's a beautiful game. Maybe they pushed it to the max, but it would be so much more immersive if I, when I went here, you'd see my hand reach out, wiggle the door. So, it's a little lacking. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to tell how it is. But if, if Sacrifice and that made the rest of the game play smoother and look awesome, I understand. I understand. Ooh. We're going to run into somebody eventually. <laughs> oh. Okay. Get a little peek over here first.
don't see anybody down there. But there's fresh flowers. There's tea down there, so this is definitely being inhabited yet. Okay. What is this? One eye is empty. So if I find an eyeball, that's going to unlock a secret room. Hmm. An eyeball is so tiny, it might be hard to find. Is that where I came from? Obviously not, or if it is, I can't go back, which I don't want to go back. Okay. Look at that detail of the wallpaper there. You can see the seam, how it sticks out a little bit. Nice. Nice effect to detail. All right, hold on now. Where are the steps to go down there? Over here? Right there, coming up. There we go, there we go. In the one house I used to, we used to have uh, hardwood floors and, and, and rugs similar to this. <laughs> used to live in a house over 100 years old, back in the day. Not a mansion like this, of course. cranny. Hmm. It looks real, but it should be artificial because there's no windows in this damn place. That plant would die from lack of light. Alright. Let's see. Yeah. <clears throat> Aha. Could there be an eyeball in here? What we got? Um... Wait a minute. Why? Why would it let me open it just to have an empty drawer? Hmm. Hmm. It's odd. I guess that's good, though. Keeps a little bit of the excitement going, so you know, like, not every drawer is going to have something in it. So it's kind of like... Oh shit, somebody lit a fire. Hmm, what's this? Examine. These are like the clothes I'm wearing. Hmm. Okay. Rejects. Dendura, Greta, Nadine, Camellia, Bianca, Melina, Astrid, Ludmila, Rosalina, Luna, Stefana, Rebea. Candidates. Irina, Mihaly, and Lois. Hmm. Another empty drawer? Come on, you're teasing me. Now you're, you're just... Oh, hello. But before I go in there... I'll make sure I did not miss any places. See? See? Oh, if there'd be an eyeball in here. Ah! Oh, I was hoping there'd be an eyeball in there. <laughs> oh. Right? But yeah, it's blood filled for sure. All right.
So I think... Look at that leather detail. Woodwork. Very nice gloss effect. But, um... So I think... I've searched everywhere now. Yep. So now we should go to the next part of the house. Oh, that was not it. So, what is this door? Okay. Oh, windows open. Oh shit, the glass is broke. Oh yeah, because that note was from 1958, so this is uh, way past the note. Hey, welcome to the stream. Launch date is May 2021. This game's going to be awesome. And keep in mind... Like, on my TV, it's 4K, but I can only broadcast in 1080p. So, like, if you have a PlayStation 5, it's going to look better on your TV than it does on the stream. That's just the nature of streaming. <clears throat> Come on, is there an eyeball in there? Ah, ah. Boom. Alrighty. Alright. But before we leave... Before we leave... Let's check out... Every little nook and cranny. We got lace work. Okay, I think that's it. Just double checking. All right. Now we go back to that picture. Ooh. Oh shit! Ooh. Oh shit. They're walking around. Save the game? Nope. <laughs> okay. Okay, which one's the painting? I think it was upstairs. Shit, and that's where they were walking. They were walking upstairs. Oh, shit. It's one of the demon sisters. Oh, shit. Okay. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. What? You can't use this as is? Maroon eye ring. An eye-shaped gem is loosely set in the string. It looks like it will come out with some effort. Okay. So. First, just in case she walks the halls again, I'm going to come down to... I'm going to... Uh, let's see. Uh, I just want to get out of here, because if she sees me, then I'm in trouble. So I just have to... Exit this area real quick. Okay, so now I'm alone. All right. So let's see. How do I... Hmm. Where's the menu? Basically, I, I'm, I'm thinking I have, to use, I have to use something to get it out of the ring. Um... It looks like it will come out with some effort. How do I... Okay, here we go. Okay. So now I got it out. Alright, alright. Alright. 
thought I was gonna have to use the pliers or something. Hey, gotta listen. Okay, I don't hear them walking. Look, a little bit of blood. Okay. Okay, hopefully that demon lady doesn't come back. Okay, here we go, here we go. Oh shit, you un unlocked it? Ooh, here we go. New area. Woohoo! Moldy fruit. All right, let's see. Up. <clears throat> oh, these bastards let me open things and nothing's in them. See that little, these little lines are annoying me. I'll be back in 30 seconds. I'm adjusting the camera because that's annoying. Takes away from the game. I'll be right back. Adjusting the blue screen. Okay, and coming back, coming back, coming back to the game. Okay. It's now smooth and clear. All right. Hmm. So what is this? The winemaking techniques of Castle... I won't even try to say it. Can be traced as far back as the 15th century long before the current occupants of the castle. Alcina Dimitriou uses this legendary yet peculiar technique to enrich the wine's flavor, intensity, and bestow it with a thick bouquet. Her best vintage is Sanquis Virginis, meaning maiden's blood. It is kept in a special ornate bottle decorated with intricate silver flowers. They mix blood in the wine, is what they do. Oh, shit. Look at those dust particles above the flame. Very nice. Very nice. Was that just to get that bonus info? There's nothing. Like, there's no new items in here to pick up? <clears throat> Maybe. Hmm. Hmm. Well. Up. Oh, was that? Did I look at this yet? Another empty one. You're killing me. You're killing me, Smalls. With these empty places. Aha. There we go. Courtyard key. This is a, just a demo. This, I mean, I don't know how much time we got left. This might be at the end already, but I would think I'm going to have to fight somebody. Or maybe the demo will be like me getting killed or something at the end. Like, <laughs> All right. Hmm. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, I know you're watching me. I got one streamer. Wait, that wasn't, this, that wasn't the person watching the stream. It was the demon girl in the game. Oh, no. Where was there a keyhole? I need a keyhole. Hmm. These don't have keyholes. Which are odd. A lock with no keyhole. But I have a key. Oh shit! Whoa, here we go! Hello! Yo! Hey! Hey! I do not consent! I do not consent! Hey! 
The more skilled you are, the thicker the blood. Hey! 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 Oh, shit. Oh, restart! Okay. Jump back to previous checkpoint. I was gonna say, don't make me restart the whole game, dude. Oh, shit! That checkpoint is pretty far, far back. Oh, wow, I have to do all that all over again. Damn. All right. So now this is where I wish it was like Cyberpunk, which gets this. Cyberpunk, I can do a quick save at any point. Now I got to do this all over again because you only got checkpoints in this game. So don't, don't hate on Cyberpunk. It's got these good points, too. All right, let's see. Oh. He's walk, walking around. Leave it open so I remember it was open. Mm. What do I got? Okay. So I got killed once so far. There was there was a little bit of action. I have no weapon yet, and it's a ghost to begin with. Alright. <laughs> oh shit. Gotta keep out of sight. Okay, so that's the door I would go to. Okay, okay. We got this now. Um, where was that eyeball at? There it is. Okay. So we pick that up. Get that ring. Examine the ring. Get the eyeball out. Okay. I forget, Veer, was there anything in here I, I got last time? I don't think so. Alright, so now... Where... Oh! Hide. I hear footsteps. Okay. I can't be seen. Okay. i to turn up my sound.
I got my sound turned up now on my headphones so I can hear footsteps. Okay. I think she's gone. Okay. We gotta very quickly get that, get what I need. Okay, put the eye in. Close the door. Close that door, bitch. All right. Oof. Okay. Okay, now we got the courtyard key. Listen for footsteps. Oh shit! Run! Run! Where was the door before? Oh shit! What the fuck? Wh wh which door was it? Which door was it? Don't okay. kill won't last until dinner. No! 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 Get out of here! Hey! Hey! Get off me! How's it feel? Run! Key, key, key. Get the hell out of here. Oh shit! Hello. So we finally meet. Too bad you wanna kill me. <laughs> you ain't too bad looking. Oh shit. What? I wonder if this is the end of the demo. There it is. Thanks for playing through our visual showcase. Pre-order Resident Evil. Press Try and go to access the PlayStation Store. All right, next. That was it. That was it. Pretty cool. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Okay, I'm, I'm going to read all this now. License terms for a cat. No, I'm not going to read all that. <laughs> all right. There it was. All righty. And I'm going to take a short break and then I'm going to keep on uh, playing Shadow of the Tomb Raider. I'm playing that, playing all my backlog games to beat every game I have. Uh, right now, we're about six hours into Shadow of the Tomb Raider. So like me if you didn't already. Follow me if you didn't already. I'll be back on in about five, ten minutes. Peace.